Hi everyone! So I am here today to review my Fermu glasses and if you guys watched one of my recent vlogs you will have seen when I got these and I was so excited. I don't need uh, prescription glasses or contacts and I've always wanted a pair of non-prescription glasses but I never bit the bullet because I didn't want to buy a pair of glasses just for fashion purposes. So when Fermu contacted me to ask me if I wanted to try a pair of their glasses from their website, I thought what a perfect opportunity because then I can play around with different look with um, non-prescription eyeglasses. So I went ahead and I placed my order and this is going to be my review. Fermu is a company that is based in China and my husband has actually ordered from them. He ordered from them about two or three years ago when Fermu was doing a big campaign with bloggers and I noticed the company and I told him about it. So he wanted to try it out. He went ahead and he bought a pair of glasses and he was really happy with them. And the funny thing is that when I ordered my pair, he had actually misplaced his pair because he had put them in the locker after taking them on a trip. So very recently we found the glasses and they are so similar to the ones I have on right now. So the shape is very, very similar. There are only slight differences. So I guess me and my husband have the same taste in eyeglasses. I'm gonna talk you through the ordering process a little bit. When you go on the website, there are hundreds of glasses to choose from, but you can use the filters to narrow down your search. So there are glasses, of course, for men and women, and the ones that I'm wearing in this video are unisex. There are also filters such as color family, materials, frame shape, and the like. Or you can use the little search function and search up a specific style and I will leave the style number of these glasses and also my husband's glasses down below. So if you like this particular shape like we do, you can go ahead and search up these frames and not have to weed through pages and pages and pages of different frames. The website's default is in US dollars but you can toggle the currency. Canadian is an option. So these particular frames were $23 US and at today's exchange rate it works out to $30.07 Canadian. When you click on the particular style that you're interested in, in, it opens up a page with a whole bunch of other information. The glasses that you're interested in may come in several colors, so you can toggle between the colors. And also there are the actual measurements of like the frames, so they suggest that you measure a pair of your own glasses to compare if you already wear glasses and you like the way they look on you. So just as a size reference, you could do that. But because this is my first pair of eyeglasses, I didn't know what frame would look good on me. So what I did was I actually took a photo and you can either use the camera on your laptop or a webcam or you can upload a picture from your camera. So I used the camera on my laptop, I took a quick photo and then it tells you to select where your pupils are so it kind of knows how to line up the glasses on your face and then you can try on a multitude of different glasses on the website. You could try on different colors. Of course, it's not going to be exactly how they look on you, but you can have some sense of whether a frame suits your face and decrease the probability of it not looking good. So when I ended up getting these glasses, I was really happy with the way they looked. And that is in part, I think, due to me having tried on a bunch using my photo. Once you've decided on the frame, there are a whole bunch of lens options. You can choose um, prescription prescription or non-prescription. I think there's a bifocal option as well. There are a whole bunch of different choices for lenses. They range in price. There are free lenses, which are the ones that my husband chose. So they're a little bit thicker, but he was saying that um, his glasses are actually like a thicker frame. So they were okay for his purposes. Although if you take a close look at his glasses, they do stick out a little bit. So Fermu actually recommends um, that you upgrade to thinner lenses but of course that is going to cost extra. And just for your reference, I have the 1.57 thin and light lenses, which cost an additional $9.95. So if you don't wanna pay extra, you will have the thicker lenses. I don't notice the extra thickness when these glasses are on my husband, but now that I'm holding the glasses in my hand, kind of side by side with the ones I have on, I do notice a difference. In terms of the coatings for the lenses, again, there are a whole bunch to choose from. Most of them are upgrades, but you do get the anti scratch included in the price of the frames. So the lenses that I have on also have an anti-reflective coating and they also have a UV coating. And on the website, if you hover over the question mark beside each option, it gives you a little bit of information about that option. I don't really know anything about glasses, so I found that really helpful when I was looking at my selections. The current price of the anti-reflective coating is $4.95 and the UV coating is also $4.95. So just so you have a sense of um, the cost of the upgrade. Grades. You can get free shipping if your order is above a certain amount. 
and you have to enter in a code to get the free shipping so just keep that in mind when you're placing your order if your order meets the minimum threshold if your order doesn't qualify for free shipping the shipping charge will be calculated when you enter in your address so to ship these glasses to me it was an additional $12.95 they do use an express courier service so my glasses came to me very quickly I think it was two or three business days and I had them in my hot little hands so overall it was a great experience in terms of the quality I find these glasses are pretty high quality again I don't have experience with eyeglasses but I've had lots and lots of sunglasses in the past I've had lots of sunglasses made in China I have a couple of pair of designer sunglasses these of course aren't going to be the same caliber as designer but I think they are much better quality than my cheapo sunglasses that I buy from winners or marshalls and the like they just have a really nice feel to them they fold up really nicely in terms of the style so they're really flat I kind of like that about my glasses they're super comfortable they're very light and I think they sit on my face really nicely they're also really well balanced so I don't feel like they're a little bit askance or anything like that included with your glasses when they ship you get a hard case that just looks like this here is what the inside looks like. You also get a lens cloth with the Fermu logo on it. You also get a little cloth bag for your glasses. And then in the cloth case, you get this little key ring thing, and it's actually a little tool for your glasses. So if you screw off the top, there's a little screwdriver for your glasses. Overall, these glasses that I'm wearing today would have come to $55.80 US, including shipping. So would I actually spend the money to purchase these myself? And the answer is yes, because I am thinking of buying another pair, probably tortoise glasses, just for fun. Again, non-prescription, but I've been having so much fun with these. I wear them every so often. It's a great little accessory to have to change up my look and I'm just having a lot of fun with these and I do want a pair of brown or tortoise ones. So that is going to be it for today. I hope you found this review helpful. If you have any questions, please just leave them in the comment section down below. I'm going to put a bunch of information in the description box as I always do. Thanks again for watching and until I see you next time, please take care and bye for now.